Vinny, after I had to do this interview with a hat and coat on, he was out there with a shirt. This man is hot. Show me the hand. Put that, put that up there. See, that makes no sense, man. How tall are you? 5'11". How are you 5'11"? Your hand's bigger than me. I'm 6'5". <laughs> um, got a lot to do with my mom, my dad, my mom. Got some big hands. Uh, hers about an inch smaller than mine. Long fingers. And my dad's just got big hands. So I guess that's where I get it from. I'm going back to turn your frustration. It's the, the rookie right now. Going down back to Sam's When the season first started out, you, you were in the doghouse. You were injured. They say you were in Coughlin Doghouse. I've been there. That's not where you want to be. How were you able to handle that? Um, it was definitely tough. I think that was the hardest thing for me was to not be able to step on the field every day and show them, you know, why I'm here and why I wanted to be here. After you're making the plays that you're making, and I'm not just talking about the catch. I'm talking about all the plays you've made. You had a phenomenal season. Is there a little bit of you that kind of goes, I told you so? <laughs> Um, to an extent, you know, just being that being the nature of a competitor, you know, you everybody plays for their own reasons. Some people play to prove others wrong. Some people play to prove themselves right. For me, it's it's you know all the people who said I couldn't do this or I wouldn't be that. I thank everybody who told me you know I couldn't do something. You know, the, the catch when they said it's the greatest catch ever. You came back with one of the most interesting responses that I've, I've ever seen out of a young guy. You say, well, I hope not because I'm just getting started. All right. Where is, where is that maturity from? Because, you know, most guys would have said, yo, put it on the poster. I'm signing there with what? I'm done. <laughs> Um, it's just, it's just my nature, you know, it's, it's something about me. I'm never satisfied with, you know, that being okay, that being the greatest catch ever. I, I would hope, you know, if it's not myself, that somebody else is going to come out there and, and, would you and do something. to be you? Well, of course, of course. <laughs> but, I, you know, somebody else come out and do something crazier than that. I always want to push the limits that you didn't think you can get pushed to. It's really been a tough year for the Giants, but I must say, the young receiving core with Eli, I mean, you got to be excited about the future. Absolutely. Um. You know, you have to be realistic with yourself and say, you know, this season wasn't what you wanted it to be, wasn't what you expected, but I don't see why we couldn't have one of the best offenses in the NFL, you know? It, it's just, why would you not think like that as being a part of that offense? But you know what, man? You're fun to watch. I'm keeping my eye on you because I want to turn over my keys to that to you. To keep on playing the way you do, it's all yours. Matter of fact, I don't have to turn them over, just going to take them. <laughs> I but appreciate good luck everything, man. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. You know, he's already set um, these New York Giants rookie receiving records. He needs four catches. Look at Brass, why are you making fun of my hat, man? <laughs> I was cold. This kid's so hot, he didn't need an ejector or hat or nothing like that. I'm he's cold. tougher than I'm me. I'm cold in here. How does this look? <laughs> but, <laughs> balling. I'm balling right now, man. <laughs> but but the, you, you, you're crazy right now, as always. <laughs> but one thing I will say about, about uh, like Dale Beckham Jr. is that he's the kind of guy that you look at and as a, as a guy, you see some of the young mm. guys, you know, I would love to play with him. He's that kind of guy for me. His attitude his commitment to winning and to being the best. I absolutely loved it. That's one of the best interviews I've ever seen. Thank you. And that does not look good look. No, it is a good look. And you're talking about Beckham, and he's done it on the field. We talked about he missed the first month of the season, yet he still leads all rookies in the number of catches, yards, and his second in touchdowns. And, of course, it was that circus catch against the Cowboys that thrust him into the national spotlight. The spotlight right now, even brighter...